welcome, comic book fan! What's going on, sir? It's a club meeting. It's downstairs. <laughs> Go ahead. Thanks. I might check it out. No, no, no! You can't use diplomacy to make the elf princess do that! Of course I can. You guys having fun? What are you doing here? You can't join our party! Give him a chance. Let him join if he can beat Fatty's Consumo high score. Why not? I can always use this place to crash. Another job well done. I always said I'd give my bottle rocket launcher to whoever beat Fatty's high score. Here, take it! I kick it! Job well done. Sir, are you okay? I just got robbed by a dorky kid and I'm having an asthma attack. Of course I'm not okay. Hey, I'll tell you what. I'll give you five bucks and some comics if you help me get my stuff back from that punk. You got a deal. that. Why'd anyone throw this away? need comics. Just give me the money. <sighs> All right. Kids these days. Simple.
Hey, what you looking at? Hey, Zoe. You want to have some fun, tough guy? What kind of fun? It's not that kind. I only date older men or junkies. They're so romantic. Come on, what's wrong with me? <laughs> well, everybody hates you. You're a little twerp. You dress terribly. But apart from that, nothing. Oh, okay. Good. Why don't we play a little game? Come on. By older men, I hope you don't mean Mr. Burton. Hey. Come on. We're going to the Spencer I'm Shipping gonna Warehouse. Beat you, you little brat. All right, Jimmy. Here we are. A warehouse full of expensive looking junk. It makes it much more satisfying that all this is Spencer shipping. Wait, isn't Tad's last name Spencer? Yup, and now we're gonna play a little game. Whoever smashes up the most stuff wins.
You win. You sure know how to have a good time, Zoe. This is the best date ever. All sorted. Mr. Galloway, should you really be doing that? Oh, Jimmy. No, I suppose not, but life is unfair. You promised Ms. Phillips. Oh, God. What kind of world do we live in where I get punished for a minor indiscretion and Hattrick gets away with taking bribes from his pupils? He does? Yes. He sells advanced copies of tests to the sons of his rich friends, and nobody says a word. Wait, what rich friends? Well, Darby Harrington, for one. I can't believe he's selling tests. What if I got evidence of him doing this? <laughs> then I'd never need to drink again. All right, let me see what I can do. Man, I'm hungry. You guys looking for something? All right, I'll pay. You drive a hard bargain. Hey, thanks a lot. Money, money. <laughs> I sure hope he shows up. I need to get my grade up. Don't worry, he'll be here soon, I'm sure. Do you have my cash? Yeah, did you bring the goods? Thanks, buddy. See you at midterms. I totally like your shoes, Jimmy. Sir, of course, I trust you have my fee. I've got daddy's checkbook with me. Top dollars for top grade. See you in class. You know, he drinks on school grounds. Think of the children, Dr. Crabblesnitch. Drinking? I will terminate the employment contract of any staff member found corrupting children. Morality is the most important lesson we can teach the youth. Is that so? Then you might want to look at these. What's this? It's that fat, evil hypocrite selling test answers to rich kids. Fire them. What? You took pictures? And to think I trusted you, Hattrick? You're fired. But I... Bye-bye, I... <sighs> fatty. And as for you, Galloway, there better not be anything to that drinking business. <laughs> 